eventually you will get a cocoon type thing that the ladybug will crawl out of. But where do those cocoon things come from? Of course, when one male ladybug decides to look for, I suppose, a female, I suppose, look for, um, and we'll just assume that this ladybug here is female because of the way it's cleaning itself. But like his journey is filled with many hardships. But you will avail soon. enough of that so ladybugs will usually come from a specific bush like a ladybug bush its home which will include a lot of different things such as this silver ladybug uh, and this rather plump dark one with a few red spots so a whole bunch of these little black dots, those black dots, which actually appear to be alive. Little baby ladybug. And it's early stages. Also, in the tree are these things that bear a striking resemblance to the cocoon things that the ladybugs fall out of. Said these are dark; and they have legs. If you look closely, they actually look like a mixture of those tiny baby dots and the cocoon things. See, they have a little color growing in there. And they also live in the same bush as regular ladybugs. I just don't think they turn into little cocoons yet. Basically, that's what happens. The, the female seems to be stronger than the male. And that's where they come from.
think the greatest harm done the human race has been done by the poets. Well, poets are dull boys, most of them, but not, not especially fiendish. They keep filling people's heads with delusions about love, 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 love.